Today on Redneck Rescue, we had a nice family here at a vacation rental, parked right here. Went to back up, got into the snow, it was a little soft, pulled the back end over, gravity took a toll. So the plan is we got the winch hooked up to the rhino tree saver with a snatch block, back to Miranda. We're gonna pull the back end over and out and then pull the vehicle down and out. You'll notice I got a D-ring that mounts to the receiver hitch. You don't ever want to pull from a drop hitch, especially a big drop, or from the ball because it could become a projectile. The new Passover on the plow is working out pretty good, pushing that blade right down to become a good anchor. See the rhino snatch block, pull the back end right over where we want to be. Today I'm a one-man show, cameraman, winch operator, video editor, all in a day of fun. We we're putting in the reverse with no throttle, turning the front tires towards the road so as the back end pulls over, the front end moves towards the driveway. So the next move is, we're gonna go off of this tree right over here with the snatch block again. We're gonna pull the front end up and over onto the road, and then we'll just back it right up and right up and out. So now we're gonna use a Rhino axle strap to run up and over the front suspension arm close to where it mounts. We're gonna use that as our pull point to pull the front end right up and over. So right now I'm holding the brakes because I want the front end to slide over. Other times I may let off the brakes or put it in reverse just to let it roll so it kind of rolls in the direction I want it to go. There's that axle strap. Makes a great soft point to hook to the vehicle. I've been really impressed with the Rhino soft shackles in the cold weather conditions. They really haven't froze up or not wanted to let go. You can get yours today at Rhino USA. Use Rescue 10 to get a discount. Now that Miranda's out of the way, we're gonna back the Jeep up just a little bit. Just get a nice straight shot up the hill and we're gonna pull it up above and park it up by the garage so that it's easy for them to get out. Moving in a positive direction. If you enjoyed today's episode of Redneck Rescue, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. We got other rescues coming down the line.